to bring up my next guest, uh, and uh, this is really interesting because um, his name is Alberto Tono. He is not an app developer. Uh, he actually uh, has an internship here in San Francisco, but he's originally from Italy. So, Alberto Tono, welcome to the stage. Hi. Please have a seat. Thank you. I'm really honored and flattered to be here with you, Seth. And I don't know if we want to start with the video so I can. Give no, I think we gotta, we gotta set the stage a little bit. We'll, we'll roll your video here soon. But uh, I just want to explain a little bit about who Alberto is and why he's here tonight. Um, and yeah, so um, there was, a, a, there was a, a workshop this past weekend in San Francisco that uh, VRARA put on. Um, and it was basically AR kit for beginners. People who had no experience building apps, computer programming, what could they build in a weekend? And uh, Alberto took, pl took part in that workshop. And uh, Sunday night, when I went and saw everything that had been done. And he was the wunderkind of the group because uh, he not only com uh, completed one experience, which successfully nine other candidates did as well, but he had completed so many different experiences over, I think it was 10, and he hit the limit for a test account on iTunes. Um, so uh, now we can, you want to talk about what we're going to see in the video here? Yeah, definitely. Uh, today I wrote for the Apple developer, so I can be a developer and I can build for how many apps I want. And no, it was a really amazing experience, thanks to also Viara that organized the Google Association and Atacop, also the Jew guy that organized the event. But this app actually is an app that everyone can develop, and it's important to how you use the tool, right? Because there is not that good tool, it's not like an eye. Uh, you can use also for it, but you can also, also for do something bad, like do you see that, right? So um, we would like to, to give the power to the user to use the app whatever they want. So like for this app, we create a video with a lot of Really good director of the movie, Hannah Gutenberg, the movie award. And you know, if you want to play, we can see and learn a little bit later. Sure, well, one last thing. Tell us just one thing about what was the assignment? What were you expected to do in the course of the weekend? Yeah, they promised to build an app, and it was really amazing. We developed in one day, let's say, eight hours. And it was really <coughs> straight to the point and with really cool content. But was there direction about what that app should be? Um, yeah, just a really good direction that we give they provide us in the beginning. Yeah. Okay, well let, let's roll the video and let's yeah. talk, talk to us about what we're going to see as we're playing it. Great. Go ahead, Jimmy, please. Good. So that's a portal, right? Yeah, it's exactly. It's really dark and it's able to recognize it and make a surface in this environment. It's the first AR movie with the recording with the eyes. And this one I was candidate for the Oscar. <laughs> <laughs> this is a magic place here in San Francisco, it's Mission Dolores Park. And actually we are running some research for the Mars mission. So that's why we like to engage with 360 video that is really also difficult to direct because you don't have the background or you know, backstage let's say. So we have to think about how to develop the video and all this stuff. And this group of researchers is mixed about artificial intelligence, computer vision, architects, so sustainability, and this is what we would like to bring to the world. How the psychological aspect of the people that are going to Mars to be with the AR. And this one I win the Razzle Award, with the award for the worst actor. <laughs> Now we're looking at footage on Mars, right? Yeah, that's what it is. It's important how you build the app. What was the hardest thing for you to do in this whole process? Actually, uh, yeah, I said, I think uh, to let people uh, uh, debugging the app. Maybe the technical part is always the hardest. And here are people really amazing. They developed really cool apps. And they were able to overpass really hard problems that Maybe for this app, or we are not facing this kind of problem that they solve, like persistency or for the computer vision. Uh, so, yeah, with that simple app, let's say, for top. But I mean, the, the idea behind this thing is really powerful. So, let the user decide their experience in the environment. And right now, with HOK, that is an architecture company, we would like to build an application for also architecture because AC film. Is always a step behind all the industry, like also with the artificial.
different intelligence we are not there. And so what we would like to bring to the industry is new ideas. So we, we are here to share with all of you some future ideas. Fantastic. Well, that's all the time we have. Um, thank you so much for being on the app show. And, uh, <laughs> Right now, if you go to m.appshow.com and you tap on uh, his app icon, you're going to go to his LinkedIn profile. So you can get in touch with him, but uh, we'll see if, if you actually launch this app. It'd be cool for you yeah. to do it. Thanks, Ed. All right, thank you for being here.